Archangel Michael is the only angel who is mentioned by name in all three of the major sacred texts of the world's religions that place the most emphasis on angels, the Torah, Judaism, the Bible, Christianity, and the Quran, Islam. In all of those faiths, believers consider Michael a leading angel who fights evil with the power of good. Michael is an exceptionally strong angel who protects and defends people who love God. He is powerfully concerned about truth and justice. Believers say that Michael communicates boldly with people when he helps and guides them. The name Michael means, who is like God, in Hebrew, and it reflects his role as God's representative and champion. He is also known as Saint Michael, Archangel Michael, and Saint Michael the Taxiarch, which means the leader of the army. He is often depicted as a warrior angel, wearing armor and holding a sword or a spear, and sometimes a shield or a balance. He is also shown as slaying a dragon or a serpent, which symbolizes Satan or the forces of evil. Michael has a special connection to Israel, God's chosen people, in the Old Testament. He is called the Prince or the Protector of Israel, and he intervenes on their behalf in times of trouble and distress. He also mediates the law of God, and stands at the right hand of the throne of God. He is the one who delivered the prophet Daniel from the lion's den, and who revealed to him the visions of the future. He is also the one who helped the angel Gabriel to overcome the resistance of the Prince of Persia, a demonic power, and to deliver God's message to Daniel. In the New Testament, Michael is mentioned in the Book of Jude and the Book of Revelation. In Jude, he is called the Archangel, and he is described as disputing with the devil over the body of Moses. He did not dare to bring a slanderous accusation against him, but said, The Lord rebuke you. This shows his humility and respect for God's authority, as well as his opposition to the devil's lies and accusations. In Revelation, he is the leader of the heavenly army that fights against the dragon, who is identified as the devil and Satan, and his angels. He defeats them and casts them out of heaven, and proclaims the victory of God and his Christ. Michael is also revered in other religions, such as Islam and the Baha'i Faith. In Islam, he is one of the four archangels, along with Gabriel, Raphael, and Azrael. He is responsible for the natural phenomena, such as rain, thunder, and lightning. He is also the angel of mercy, who rewards the righteous and the faithful. He is said to have 600 wings, each covered with saffron and pearls. In the Baha'i Faith, he is one of the manifestations of God, who reveals God's will and guidance to humanity. He is associated with the principle of justice, and he is the one who heralds the coming of the Baha'i Messiah, Baha'u'llah. Michael is not only a powerful and majestic angel, but also a loving and compassionate one. He cares deeply for God's people, and he is always ready to help them in times of need. He is the patron saint of many countries, such as France, Germany, and Vatican City, and of many professions, such as police officers, military personnel, and bankers. He is also the patron of the dying, the sick, and the poor souls in purgatory. He is invoked for protection, courage, strength, and healing. If you want to connect with Archangel Michael, you can do so by praying to him, meditating on his presence, or asking for his signs. You can also use his symbols, such as his sword, his shield, his balance, or his color, which is blue or purple. You can also wear his medals, his statues, or his images, or visit his shrines, such as Mont Saint Michel in France, or the Sanctuary of Saint Michael the Archangel in Italy. You can also read his stories and messages in the scriptures, or listen to his songs and hymns. Archangel Michael is a faithful and loyal servant of God, and a friend and a guardian of his people. He is always watching over you, and he is always ready to assist you. He will give you the confidence and the wisdom to face any challenge, and he will lead you to the truth and the justice of God. He will also prepare you for the glorious day when Christ will return, and he will raise you up to the eternal life in heaven. He is the Archangel of the end times, and he is the Archangel of hope. I hope you enjoyed this video, and learned something new about Archangel Michael. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, and share it with your friends. And if you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel, and hit the bell icon to get notified of new uploads. Thank you for watching, and may Archangel Michael bless you and protect you always.